Why is that dude just straight up tied up? He's tied up. Oh crap. Oh, get some. Going undercover. Oh, look at these heathens. Look at this in the middle. That dude's vibing. My dude's still vibing. Look at him, look at him go. Heathens, man. Oh, shit. I think she landed on her head. Let's do this. Oh, six, you're an animal. Run! Holy moly. Oh, and there's the, uh, there's the little nightmares iconic ring jacket. Very nice. There it is. All right, where are we now? Trying to remember what this is is oh I oh okay yeah buddy seriously the uh enemy models in this game kind of nuts <laughs> I just remember kind of nuts oh this is probably one of the best parts of the game Oh, th I think this is hands down one of the best parts of the game. Help me open this door. Can I open this door? Yeah, I think this is one of the best parts of the game. Shit. Excuse my language. Alright, come on. Come on, six. Baseball slide. Yo, thanks for the save. That almost ended very badly. Thanks, six is an animal. Look at her go. What the heck is this place? Uh, excuse me? Like, is this supposed to be some sort of hospital? What is this place? I see. All right, so you gotta mess with the fuse, I guess. This game is so dark. I love it. But yeah, the enhanced version so far has been very smooth. It's, I, I've encountered a minimal amount of clunkiness. It's, it's, uh, it's definitely not noticeable. 
Before I do anything, hold on. Did the settings also mess with this? Okay, no, we're good. All right, we're good, we're good, we're good. But yeah, we encountered a minimal amount of clunkiness. so dark in here. Here we go, finally. I love has how What was I gonna say? I love how it kind of goes like these games go into the whole deal of playing with a light source. Well, part one, you played with the lighter. Well, well, not really played with it, but like to make light. And then here we got this flashlight. Then as a kid, clearly, or at least I did. I don't know about anyone else. Um kind of just hang around kind of hang around at night or in the dark and then have the flashlight and then just kind of walk around the house kind of just play pretend kind of go exploring in the dark with the flashlight so, something about doing that in the dark I don't know if anyone else I don't know if anyone else also did that as a child or even now I don't do it now because if I stub my toe on something, I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> All right, hold on. let's uh, let's backtrack real quick to see what was down this hallway. Let's see if there's anything down this hallway. If this can even be considered a hallway. I feel like there'd be like a hat. Oh, I I'm, I figured I'm like, man, there has to be something this way. We got a shadow figure kid, a glitchy kid, or whatever they are. I don't remember what. I don't know. I'm not quite sure what happens if you get all of them. Uh, I'm not sure if it affects the the cutscene at the end. I'm not sure if it uh if it alters the ending a little bit. I'm not sure. I feel like I need to do a run where I just go for all the collectibles. That'd be that'll be good. I feel like I would need to consult with my child. I'm like, sir. I need help finding these hats. <laughs> I need help finding the hats and the glitchy kids. They'll probably be like, look, dad, I got you. They're over here and over there. No, go back. Apparently he told me because uh, I was uh, I was editing the first video. <laughs> He's so funny. I was editing the first video when we were in the uh, in the forest with the hunter. And he asks me. Did you get the glitch kid that was behind the tree trunk? I'm like, what tree trunk, man? He's like, yeah, man, when you when you when you roll down the tree, when you go, when you slide down the tree trunk, when you're inside the tree trunk, 
you can go behind it and there's a glitch kit back there i'm like oh well i done i done missed all of that <laughs> i done missed all of that a big fan of the series he's a big fan of the series he even has like uh he has a mono and um he has a mono and six plushies He has mono and six plushies, which is cute. Like the TV sucking me in. Land. I feel like this is just all some sort of subliminal like this has to be some sort of tripped out dream for Mono and each time he gets pulled out by six he's all like I'm trying to get to the door And she's all like, bro, you need to stop going inside the TVs, dude. He's all like, I don't know what happened. He's like, you need to stop going inside the TVs. It's not good for you. You're consumed. Consumed by the TV. But yeah, six is all like, bro, no more, bro. You need to stop it. What are you doing with the toy, sick? He just picks up a random toy. Also, what's going on here? Okay, let's see. There's an x-ray machine. Oh, apparently one of the... Okay, I didn't see this. Apparently one of the stuffed animals has a toy in it. All right, Six, so what's going on? You going to go back there? Oh, that's tripped out. Nope, that's not what we're looking for. Could it be this one? Let's see if it's this one. I like how she just keeps <laughs> carrying that toy, even though we've confirmed there's it's not it. Let me drop the toy here, and uh, let's see. Excuse me. Okay, so this thing doesn't have it. Big old stuffed animal. This dude's as big as freaking Manu. But yeah, I'm wondering what kind of enemies these are like. Like, I feel like I need to read up more on the lore. To kind of figure out why the adults in this world are all deformed and like the children are like tiny. It could all just be a metaphor for how kids perceive things you know if we're, we're trying to get philosophical like that it could just be that it's a it's a metaphor for how kids perceive the world around them there we go oh 
Okay, so it's this toy. So what are, what am I supposed to do with this with this mono here? Oh, if I'm not mistaken, I think we gotta incinerate it. That might be it. What is it? what's in here? I made a mistake. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we need to incinerate it. Anything in here? Nope. Yeah, we 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 may need to incinerate it. Okay, so how do we get the stuffed animal in here i i like how six is just carrying that toy like six you can drop it you can drop the toy we've confirmed where the key is like we've, confir we've confirmed the location of the key and i forgot to bring it with me There, there, there was something inside. There's something inside of that toy. Kind of looked like an axe to me. Like an axe head? I don't know. Could just be me. Okay, well, then we still... Okay, Mono. Don't, don't. Okay, so see... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Did I just burn a gnome? Uh, I, I hope I didn't. Why was that toy like making noises? Uh oh. Did I just incinerate an innocent gnome? I hope I didn't. Oh man, I'm gonna have to take a look at those x rays. Oh man, did I? Oh, jeez. I really hope I didn't. Oh, and I didn't even bother to see what's up here before getting the key. Well, we have a key. What? What is the key for? I'm not sure. Oh, for this. But it worked out. It worked out. All right, so it looks like we need two fuses. Oh man. Oh man, this is creepy. I don't know if I like this. Oh, this is messed up. Is there anything behind this closed door? I always gotta confirm. Because there might be a hat just hiding in plain sight and you won't see it. Did 
this isn't good. Oh, another kid. Let's go. I, I don't know what these kids do, though. And, like, who are they supposed to be? But yeah, I can't wait for Little Nightmares 3. I hope the I hope Supermassive Games is able to deliver the same the same type of atmosphere that Tarsier oh shit. The same the same type of atmosphere that Tarsier was able to do with these two. So I wish them all the success with that because this is this is one of my favorite uh game franchises of all time. Which now that I mention it, uh, it took me forever. I remember when this when Little Nightmares first, Little Nightmares one first came out. Uh, I remember watching PewDiePie play it. My name's PewDiePie. What is that dude doing these days? It's been years since I've seen a PewDiePie video or even heard of the man. What the heck? What the heck? Thing's hand just moved by itself. Oh man. Okay. Don't like that. Is there a way to aim the? Fl I can't remember if there's a way to aim the flashlight. I like that. I don't like that at all. What the heck? Oh, no, that gave me chills. Oh, this crazy ass hand is giving. Oh, my goodness. This hand is giving me chills. Oh, that's a long way out there. What, 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 how are you going to play it, hand? crap yeah no i don't like that don't like that definitely don't like that i find that particularly frightening because when i was a kid <laughs> this is where all the this is where i started trauma dumping on you Um, my dad would always mess with me, talking about if you don't go to sleep or if you misbehave, la, la mano pachona is gonna come out or whatever. I to this point, I don't know if it was some sort of dumbass old old person joke that he was telling me. I still don't know to this day if it was just some dumb twisted shit he was telling me, like uh. Like a double, double entendre type of, type of thing. But he would tell me that the Mano Pachona would come out and like, fucking kill me or something. I don't fucking remember. But I'll But yeah, I'd always remember he'd fucking say some shit like that. 
and that, that fucking stayed with me. I see this dumb shit. I'm tripping. with this hand run it mano oh we're fu oh we're fighting oh we're fighting the hand I'm not scared of you that much. Uh, we gotta. <laughs> that's a that's an actual achievement. That's amazing. Better safe than sorry. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That is an actual achievement. That's amazing. All right, we got a fuse. Oh man, those hands are freaky though. Now, let me take a look if there's anything in this room that we may have missed. Uh, I did a lot of panicking. Well, let's just kind of backtrack a little bit real quickly. Um, just to make sure there isn't any like glitchy kid or any potential hats we may have missed. That's hilarious though. That's an achievement. Better safe than sorry. Oh, I can't go back up anymore. Okay. That's actually funny. That was completely unintentional. I didn't know that was an achievement. under here no my hat's too big <laughs> oh we may be hold on this glass we may be able to break through it there it is oh dude you just stepped on glass bro what the heck is six doing Oh, she's not over here. Ah, I thought she was over here. I hear Six doing something over here. What are you doing? Yeah, Six is just being a weirdo. Okay, I'll leave you be. What are you doing? He's like, huh? I'm not doing anything. <laughs> what are you doing? You're breaking fingers. Come on, man. Quit playing. <laughs> Quit messing around, Six, man. I'm over there fighting for my life. What the hell is that noise? I'm over, I'm over there fighting for my life. She's over here chilling. She's big chilling. All right, what's on this side? Oh, there's another fuse. Okay, so how do I... Is there a way to get through here? Oh, no, we may need to grab the fuse we just deposited. We may need to grab that to open this door. Hold on, let's see if that's the case. Yeah. Not what I meant to do, but... You get the point. Alright, let's go put it on this door. Maybe the door will open. to do this in a uh, particular order otherwise it doesn't work there it is. please no more hands
Okay, well, there's a fuse here. But I think... Hold on. Can we manipulate? No. I was gonna say maybe we can grab a box. I'm pretty sure if I grab that, the few the door's gonna close on me. Positive. Okay, here we go. There's an entry here. All right, six. Boost me up, chick. Ah, what the fuck. about these things oh that's not that's not it chief oh this ain't it chief oh this place is full of mannequins oh this ain't it chief this i don't know how i forgot about this this is probably the most terrifying section of the game That's not, that's not it, Chief. This ain't it, Chief. I don't like this. Oh, this ain't it. This ain't it. Oh, this ain't it. You don't know which one's gonna turn on you. And then what sucks about this area is that There's a clunkiness to the game, right? And then you're trying to keep these things from killing you. I just, it just all flooded. It, it all just came back. You're trying to keep your flashlight focused on the enemy, but like the controls are so wacky sometimes it's like, How do I even manage that? Is there anything over here? Damn it, what, what, why do I have to come exploring? Why did I have to? Uh, I was like, okay, we gotta make sure there's nothing there, bro. Why? Oh, this is not pleasant. Nope. This isn't pleasant at all. That's the crazy thing. You you don't know which one's gonna turn on you. Is there anything over here? We gotta explore, Mr. Mono. You never know when there might be a glitchy kid or a hat somewhere.
You never know. Meanwhile, I'm doing all of this. What is Six doing? She's just like, la, 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 la. <laughs> I'm over here dying. Oh, look at this. Secret, secret entry or something. Glitchy kid. that thing's supposed to be i don't know we found a glitchy kid that's why it doesn't hurt to look around doesn't hurt to look around one bit kidding me dude oh God, that's awful that is awful did it save the grabbing this dude hold on let me quick run it real quick okay yes it did what happens if i jump down there can i jump down there I died. Okay. Don't go down there. Learned, learned my lesson quick. Alright. Alright, let's get through this hallway as quickly as we can. Give me the creeps. Okay, what's going on here? Mm. What does this do? The door? Throw that bar of soap at the button, bro. Do it. get up there this is disturbing wait can I put can I push the wheelchair cannot pull the wheelchair Okay, I think I get, I think I know what I'm supposed to do. Can I turn the lights back off? Yep. Oh, 
on you buddy boy <laughs> I got my uh <laughs> I got my paper bag hat I'm 10 steps ahead brother okay cool 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 okay let's just hope the lights don't turn off <laughs> let's just let's let's hope the lights don't turn off and uh kind of eat my words there all right cool okay okay hold on mistakes for me Perfect. Oh man, there's a lot. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, there is a lot going on here. A lot of dudes. Oh, I'm gonna die. gonna make that. I thought I was gonna die. Oh, I didn't think that was gonna... Oh. Have a ball. Oh, I'm not going back for that. Those things are still moving. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I didn't think I didn't think I was gonna make that. Well, that worked out. What what were we shocking? I just realized like, what's up here? This looks like a ladder. No? Okay. I'm over here fighting for my life and Six is just sitting. She's just like big chilling up there. I'm like, hey man. You gotta help you gotta help me out. <laughs> well, she's like, hey, we can't we can't go jump up there. Holy moly. I'm alive, you should have seen the mannequins. Well, I'm kind of glad we got through that. With uh, minimal casualties. <laughs> well, with the exception of me jumping in the hole and the clunkiness getting me got once. But you know what? That wasn't bad. Oh, wait, look at that. Six comes in. Oh, that's amazing. I don't recall if the Xbox One version did that. Good job. I don't recall if the Xbox version did that. I'm glad to have been to kind of have wrapped up the mannequin section though that is 
probably one of the most more terrifying parts of this game. Well, shit. 